बिस्मिल्लाम वेलकम टू माई चैनल लर्न मैथ विथ सैयद अली टूडे वी हैव अ वर्ड प्रॉब्लम हियर एंड इट इज ऑल्सो अ क्वाड्रेटिक फंक्शन और क्वाड्रेटिक इक्वेजन क्वेश्चन ग्रेट टेन मैथ क्वेश्चन इज अ रेक्टेंगल हैज डायमेंशन एक्स प्लस टेन एंड टू एक्स माइनस थ्री एक्स प्लस टेन एंड टू एक्स माइनस थ्री डिटर्मिन द वैल्यू ऑफ एक्स दैट गिवस एन एरिया ऑफ फिफ्टी फोर सेंटीमीटर स्क्वायर एरिया ऑफ फिफ्टी फोर सेंटीमीटर स्क्वायर सो वी नो दैट एरिया ऑफ अ रेक्ट एंगल इज लेंथ टाइम्स विथ एरिया ऑफ rectangle is length times width and both of them are given us in terms of algebraic expression x plus 10 and 2x minus 3 so we have to put it here the data and what we need is 54 cm right so length times width length is x plus 10 Times width two x minus three should be equals to what that is given in our question fifty four centimeter square. So this is our basic equation, and when we expand these two brackets, these two brackets, we have the quadratic equation, and then we have to solve those th that quadratic equation for the value of x. So let's begin uh, solving it. so when we say that these two these two brackets are being multiplied that means x is being multiplied by 2x minus 3 and plus 10 is also multiplied by 2x minus 3 and that is equals to 54 so we continue to open it that will be giving us 2x square minus 3x 20x Ten times three is thirty minus thirty, and if we bring this fifty-four to this side, it will be minus fifty-four, right? And now we can say that it's equals to zero. So we can remove this equal because we are putting that. Okay, so now we have two x square minus three x and plus twenty x, right? So what we have here, seventeen x plus seventeen x. Minus thirty and minus fifty-four gives you minus eighty-four equals to zero. This is our quadratic function or quadratic equation, right? We have to solve this equation for the value of x because we he is asking value of x which gives the area of fifty-four, and we have equated that to uh, equals to fifty-four centimeters square. So whatever we get in x, that will be the value in centimeter, right? So now we have to break it. So what what is our rule? Rule is that coefficient of x square will be multiplying with the constant. So what we have to do is two times eighty four, and two times eighty four is two for the eight, two for the sixteen, one sixty eight, and we have to break one sixty eight in two factors, which on multiplication or subtraction give me the middle term, which is seventeen plus seventeen x. So I try to break it now. Okay, so all possible factors are eighty four two to the sixteen, two for the eight two, and then two to the four one, and then I can pass three three seven to the twenty one, and then I can pass seven. Right. So there are few factors. So we can say two times two times two. Is eight eight times three is twenty four. I believe that will work because that is twenty four times seven. Twenty four times seven is one sixty eight. And if we subtract twenty four minus seven, that gives me the middle term seventeen. So my factors are plus twenty four and minus seven. Hope you understand this. We have done it uh, several time. and uh, student must practicing how to get the factor into like break the factor into four steps right so now we have to write it to who x square plus 24x minus 7 7x right minus 7x i will write really write it uh, minus 7x 
right, minus 84 equals to 0. And then we have to pair it up, my step, and then I have to take the common, and 2x is common, x plus 12, right, minus 7 is common, x plus 12 again equals to 0, and these two brackets has to be same, and we are seeing that they are same, where we have to keep them once in the bracket, and whatever we took out as a common, I have to put it into the separate bracket, 2x minus 7. So now we have two factor, x plus 12 equals to 0, or 2x minus 7 equals to 0. Here, this will give us a negative value, so we will neglect this answer because x cannot be negative, x in this case we have to measure it, the area or the dimensions. So we will take, we will cancel this one, right, and we will take this answer, 2x minus 7 is equals to 0 means 2x is equals to 7, and then x is equals to 7 divided by 2, which is equals to 3.5 centimeter. So this is our answer, that if x is, if x is 3.7, uh, 3.5 centimeter, then if I substitute back into this equation, I will get this area of 54 centimeter square. I can give you this uh, task as a homework. You can uh, go ahead, substitute this value of 3.5 into these two expressions, get your length and width. This is your length, this is your width. Get them and then multiply them to get 54. And give me the comments if you get 54, if you have any question, if you have some trouble with this, getting that area, um, you can email me and my email address is s underscore s h a h i d shahid underscore ali at hotmail.com. You can send me your questions. So subscribe my channel, press the bell icon button. Uh, to receive another video so hope you like the video and uh, if you like it subscribe it and press the bell icon button to receive the next video so we will be continuing our grade 10 questions in the in the in the next video and we will make some more practice thank you for watching